Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, anyways, I made a bunch of videos today, but I wanted to change, so I changed my shirt into the sparkly thing. Um, anyways, and I put the applied those little heart stamp things. So, I really do like this new um, software. It is very, so much better than the Logitech. It's called Debut. And I was able to download it, and it, it's like, I can do so much with it, like, um, I could record <clears throat> the computer. Sorry, I know, I'm making noises. <clears throat> Let me open this, maybe it'll help. I'm just gonna... So, anyways, I'm just gonna talk a little bit. But yeah, this is so much better, you can do, like, different, um, you know, things. I can put a timestamp on. Whatever. Mm. Is it April 1st? Is it? It is. It's April Fool's Day. How come I didn't see anyone posting April Fool's Days anywhere, you know? I didn't see that. Wow, I have to pay my rent. Yeah, I have to pay my rent. I have to drop off the rent check. <laughs> Ugh, this shirt is itchy, though. But this this um, is really cool because I can have different, like, stuff. Um, let's see. Okay, how do I get out of that one? Uh, let's put it back to normal color. I kind of messed around with the, the lighting, though. You know, I like filters and stuff like that. Whoa, sorry. I like filters and whatnot, um, like on Instagram and all that stuff. And I wish there was, like, a program that gave you filters for your webcam. I know there is sometimes. Um, you know, I'd like to find that. <sighs> Unless I could just do it myself somehow. I don't know. So, yeah. What am I going to talk about? Uh, I just want to relax today. Like, I just want to chill. I know I have to pack and get ready for my trip that I'm going on. I'm going to Vegas and LA. I, it's not even my plans to go there. I'm not the one saying I want to go. Um, my friend Moss is always inviting me on these trips. Um, we're friends, uh, you know, it is kind of weird though that, you know, I'm engaged and whatnot and it's weird to go on a trip um, with with another friend, a guy friend, you know, it's just weird. Like I understand that and it people, it's hard for people to understand. They're like, why is she going on these trips with him, you know? He's my friend and he's the one that wants me to go on these trips. I don't know. He wants a big moss taraj in um in Vegas. So I guess that's what I'm you know, he wants his people around him to surround him. I'm gonna record the trip so you'll see. Um the ACM awards are happening and we're in Vegas like this coming weekend. So we're gonna do it up. But then after that I I would I would rather go to LA than Vegas. I, I used to live in LA, you know, I lived um, <clears throat> in Hollywood and Beverly Hills. I used to live out there, so that feels more like a home to me than Vegas. Vegas is too much. <laughs> like, there, we're always going to be around, there's going to be people around, and I'm, I, I don't like being around people all the time. I need my me time. Like, right now, this is my me time. Making YouTube videos and whatnot and, like, doing my thing. I drink a couple beers by myself, you know, but I, I like that, okay, like, I feel safe and whatnot, so anyways, if I'm around too many people, I start to feel, like, I start to get weird, I don't know, uh, like, I just, I can't handle it, but it should be crazy and fun, but I just, I need time to myself, <sighs> I need time to unwind, so anyways, um, we're gonna go there for that, um, that whole thing, you know, for the ACM Awards. He has a suite. He always gets a suite. Like, suites, you know, to stay in. We're gonna stay at the Signature, I think he said that. And it's a nice, you know, it's a nice building. I think there's a balcony and, like, like, I always sleep in the living room with, on the pull-out couch, um, thing. And he s sleeps in the regular room and then I think... Sarah, our friend Sarah is going to be out there and her kids. So I'm like, you know, I really, I don't want to share a room with anybody. I mean, I, I really, I'm looking forward to seeing Sarah because I like, she's my friend, you know, but I also need time 
to myself, I, you know, I need my own privacy, you know, and yeah, that's just the whole thing. Also, Moss is friends with, and I'm friends with him too, Ron Jeremy, like, Moss is like, really good friends with him, <laughs> so he invited Ron to go there to do a, um, to be on the air on the radio with, um, Buzz Brainerd, um, Moss is like, he really loves Buzz Brainerd, did you see how shining? Whoa. Buzz Brainerd. DJ Buzz Brainerd. So, I guess Ron is going to be on the radio or something because he has to promote a comedy show. I don't know. It's just all crazy to me. And I'm like, I can't do this. Like, I can't be doing this anymore. Like, Moss has to realize, you know. Also, there's Light Lake Tahoe coming up and... Moss is also friends name dropping with Jack Jack Wagner, who's an actor too. Um, he was married to Heather Locklear, but Moss is friends with him too. So we're gonna go to a celebrity golf tournament in Lake Tahoe, and that's in July. So I do want to go to that. Though. I'm not gonna lie, I like to I do like to be around celebrity type of things and events. It's kind of it's exciting. Why not? You know. We're going to try to get into some after parties. Hopefully we do, like at the ACM Awards. So hopefully we could hang out with the country stars and all that, you know. But we'll see. <laughs> um, my hair looks weird. I don't know if I like it like that. I'm just going to do that. I don't know. Something's up with my hair. It's the bangs. I got to get my, I want to get my bangs cut, actually, you know. But I haven't had time to really do anything. I didn't do anything today. Yeah, I want to get my bangs cut. It looks so much better. Um. I didn't really do anything today. I was just a waste. I went to Target and got stuff. Oh yeah, so when I'm in LA, I also won a car ride with Angeline in her pink Corvette. You know Angeline? Um, Google her. She was like an icon like um, in Hollywood. Um, and she has her billboards up and everything. She's, she's a really interesting person. And somehow I won a car ride with her. Um, I read about it, and, you know, read up about it. And a lot of people, win this but she wants you to buy her merchandise which is cool I'll, I'll buy her merchandise you know that'd be awesome really I would love to record it for YouTube I'm gonna I my one friend who's who works he's a writer out in Hollywood he, um you know he writes like his own scripts and also he's a writer and bartender and whatever but he knows like about all that and he said hey why don't you ask her you know if she, you can record it for for your channel and he said she would like she would appreciate the exposure because I do have a platform. No, I don't. Know. I have a YouTube channel and people watch it. So by doing this, it will show her, you know, and therefore get more viewers to her channel or whatever she has going for her. I don't know. <laughs> so that's what my friend suggested. So I asked Moss if if I should do. I said nobody does anything for free. Uh, Ron doesn't do anything for free. Uh, and I'm like, you. every time he says something, he's wrong all the time. So I'm like, you're always wrong about things. I, I think she would be okay. If, if not, then, you know, I won't film, but maybe I can. I, I've already seen a video of somebody, um, yeah, um, fil driving with her. She has a pink Corvette, a little pink Corvette. I don't know. But yeah, so she, um, so I'm going to do the Corvette ride with her. And then after that, we're going to have lunch. And Moss is going to meet us up, meet up with us for lunch, I guess. We'll see how it goes. And I also want to go to the Saved by the Bell, um, the Saved by the Bell, the Max restaurant, okay? Yeah, the Max restaurant is what I want to go to. And I'm trying to see if I could do anything about these bars on the side. Like, I'd like to make them glittery and stuff, you know? Yeah, so, um... We're gonna do that, you know, go to the diner, the Saved by the Bell, the Max Diner. Go to YouTube and put that in and look for it, because it looks cool. Like, I want to check it out, you know? Mm. And what else? I don't know. Just chill, hang out. So, to people that subscribe to my Patreon, I am going to work on that more. I know it's hard to do things when you're, like busy I have subscribers to my patreon channel actually but it's um the smoking cigarette channel so if you want to subscribe to that well go to my smoking channel find it 
But I do want to do footage of that, like, when I'm... This looks kind of cool if I could just style this a little bit, you know? Yeah. So it would be nice, actually. I'm kind of excited for this trip. I know I'm, I'm acting like, you know, not grateful, but it's always an interesting time. Of course, I don't really have anything to wear. But, <clears throat> whatever. Anyways, what else? What else? Uh, excuse me. Um, so last night, well, I was hungry, right? I was going to go, my plans were to go to, to our friend Weston's house because Mike, on Saturday night, he, his friend came over and we chilled and drank some beer and just talked and hung out. Sunday, I went to church. To, um, I was going to just go to Mike's or Weston's house with Mike and we're going to, he has 82 inch TV. We were going to watch, um, we were just going to watch the Walking Dead season finale and I wasn't going to drink. <laughs> I wanted to just chill and relax because I wanted to, to, I wanted to wake up moderately early, not hungover. I didn't wake up hungover, but I woke up all, me my day was messed up, you know? So anyways, I was hungry and I didn't know what I was going to eat for dinner because I don't have food here. I'm not grocery shopping because I'm going on a trip. Let me drink this beer. Oh, so Shannon messaged me and she's like, she's like, you want to come over? Um, you want to come over for dinner? Um, we're going to have a taco bake. And I was like, oh, sure. That sounds nice. She's like, we can paint after. I was like, okay. So I went over there and I was just so hungry. I just wanted food and I didn't, I don't, I felt like having homemade food. So <clears throat> she gave me her boy, her new boyfriend made it. Um, and it was good, you know, a taco big, I don't know. Um, and then she, um, oh, also she smokes weed, you know, she has a New Jersey license. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh gosh, that was just not good. Sorry. Oh wow, I didn't do that on purpose. Um, <laughs> she smokes pot, right? So I, I really don't do that. I don't like. It's just not my thing, you know. But anyway, she wanted to smoke a blunt, right? Hey, it's legal here. Shut up. <laughs> um, so, um, what happened? Oh yeah. I was driving her and she wanted to, she just got, she just got over being sick, you know what I mean? And like, I think I had to give her a ride to her house or something and then she asked me if I wanted to put in for like, something like, uh, I don't do drugs or nothing like that and I was just like, you know, I'm not gonna put any money in for like, something like that, you know, I'm like, I didn't know what she wanted to do and I'm just like, I don't know. I was like, I don't know. I could get wine if you want. She went to get wine, so she gave me she gave me ten bucks for wine. That's pretty cool, you know. <laughs> but I said, are you okay if you drink like a glass of wine? Because her, she has a liver, you know. I just have the liver. She found out. That's another thing too. Um, like, I I know you can't get it from being in contact with somebody, but you have to be careful, especially like when somebody like sneezes or like. Cause sometimes she's, she, she oh, I, I gave her a ride and she like threw up, like she, she got motion sickness, but it was like watery, but she cleaned it up. Um, but I'm just trying to be careful cause I don't want to get, I don't want to get like hepatitis, you know, but she's my friend. I'm not going to be like, you know, you shouldn't be, you can't, <clears throat> it's, you can't really catch it unless you share needles, I guess, or sex. Oh, that was weird. I heard something you know, unprotected sex or whatever, and I'm not worried, like, I just, you know, want to be a little careful, because I don't want to get sick either, you know, you know, yeah, it's sad, and, you know, I was so s worried about her for the longest time, because I remember visiting her in the, um, in the hospital, and she's like, she looked really bad, she really thought she was gonna die, she was talking like she was about to die, she's like, they're sending me home. It's hospice care. They want me to die. And she was, like, losing it a little bit. Like, her mind was lost. Like, she said, it's, yeah, that's what happens when you're about to die. You, it was just so scary. 
Um, I brought my uncle and my dad over and they prayed for her, you know, um, and we all prayed for her and like, you know what, it's a miracle, <laughs> like miracles happen, like I strongly believe in that and we prayed for her and she's doing better now, like she's doing much better, but I just worry about her because I don't want her to fall into bad habits, like if she was doing drugs or whatever she, you know, I don't know, like I don't really know her situation, I don't really hang out with her too much anymore. This shirt is really itchy. I don't want her to get involved with that kind of, get involved with drugs or even drinking. Like, I don't want to drink with her. But anyway, she, um, she's like, I said, D I can get wine, I guess. And she said, just because I didn't want to get, she wanted to get, like, drugs. Like, I don't want to do that. Like, I'm not putting in for that. Sorry. I don't, I just don't do, I don't do drugs, okay? Um, but yeah, she, uh, she was like, yeah, we could get wine then. I can have a glass. And I was like, are you sure? Like, are you sure you want, is that okay? I didn't really want to get it actually. I didn't want to drink, but you know, I don't know either. <laughs> so I got a big thing of wine. <clears throat> I was going to get the smaller bottle, but I figured, you know, just for a couple more bucks, I could get the big, you know, the big thing that Carlo Rossi stuff. I got a white one, which is really bitter and everything. Um, I gotta change. Just a minute. This is really itchy. Hold on. Ah! <laughs> this shirt is so much better. It's softer. The other one was like, has sequins on it, and it's just itching, you know? I, that's why I never wear that shirt. It's just itchy. It's a cool shirt, but it, you know. But anyways, like I was saying, um, you know, she, um, she just needs to be careful. That's all, you know? I, I was, like, really thinking... I mean, she's doing much better. She was walking with a cane, you know, she's doing a lot better. But she does smoke pot and stuff, I guess, just to help her, I don't know, with the pain. It's medical marijuana. No, it doesn't matter. But, um, you know, so we went to her house and I, and I got the wine and whatnot and we had the paint and she wanted, she rolled up a blunt. Um, and she's like, she passed it to me. I'm like, um, okay, like, I really didn't want to like smoke I'm so bad with peer pressure like I am I'm weak you know you didn't have to do it I know I mean I don't like I would never get pressured to doing anything else like heroin or you know those kind of things but smoking pot come on really it's not but anyways person like we smoked it and we with her boyfriend and stuff oh my god I got so like stoned like really like, and I don't like that feeling like I don't like to be I don't know I just don't like it because I feel like my I felt my heart beating fast you know I mean that was good weed, weed but I my heart started being really fast and I felt like I was falling asleep and I, I don't like it because everything feels slow and it's like I'm waiting patiently for it to go to pass like to so I don't feel that way anymore and I'm just like you're unmotivated and it's like you don't do you, nothing gets accomplished and you just kind of like I just don't like it like it's just not for me I don't know you know so um I like to stretch so <laughs> yeah but we painted after we had our wine with a little bit of um ice cubes and then we went to the bathroom to smoke a cigarette and we're just sitting there I'm like oh we we're watching that Momo thing that she showed me and I'm just like Oh, uh, that's really weird. That's like creepy. Uh, you know. And we painted and I painted an earth with the galaxy. I left it at her house though because she's going to I was going to dry and I told her to work on it if she wants. I want that painting though cuz I liked it and I made it. But um I had one glass of wine and then uh, and I didn't know what was going on. I was like, are we going to get going cuz my friend Sarah wanted to hang out. She's been wanting to hang out for a while, so she wanted to hang out, actually. So even if I wasn't hanging out with Shannon, I probably would have ended up hanging out with, with Sarah. But, um, yeah, so Sarah wanted to hang out, and she called me on the thing, on the voice uh, messenger or whatever. And she's like, what are you doing? Um, I was like, I'm at Shannon's house. And she's like, oh, you know. <clears throat> oh, I have, like, phlegm. Sorry, it's not like... So, <clears throat> so anyways, um... So I was like, Shannon, what are we doing? Because Sarah wants to hang out, so I don't know if what you want to do or what. 
She's like, oh yeah, I can come over and hang out, you know. So I was like, really? <laughs> okay. I haven't seen Shannon, so all right, come over, I guess. You know, uh, she's an adult. Well, anyway, so she came over here and we were hanging out. We made that little video <laughs> and everything. And then um, we were drinking the wine. Oh my God, this is what I wanted to say. So um, let me take another sip of beer. Ooh. So yeah, you know, um, we were driving in the car. She lights up a cigarette. <clears throat> so I turned to go onto my street to go home. <clears throat> There's a cop at the little intersection. Our street was here like that. We were driving through this way. The cop is right there. So not only, so the thing is, I just drank. Well, I was waiting for her. She was taking a long time. I'm like, what are we going to do? Are we going to get going? Like, she, Sarah wants to hang out. She was like, yeah, we get going. So I was like, all right, well, I had a little half a glass, like a little small thing. I put a little bit more wine. That's all I drank, okay, because I don't want to be drinking and driving. I had one glass, which is a small little, it was actually in a coffee mug, so it wasn't really a lot. I had like one and like one fourth, and that's the truth. A wine, and I smoked pot, and I, and I actually am admitting, oh, shit, am I going to get arrested for this? Why do people, like, say things like this? Sometimes, like, yeah, I am foolish for talking about this. Like, I can get in trouble. Please don't tell. Actually, I'm trying to be healthy and focus on healthy eating and healthy lifestyle. And I actually do want to give up drinking and I'll, you know, I want to be healthy and secure. And I don't like um, smoking pot. I don't like the way it makes me feel. You know, I don't like, you know, I do drink, I guess, but... I don't know. <laughs> so we were driving and it, she lives right down the street from me. But anyway, she, she lit up a cigarette and the cop was there and she flicks it out. She throws it out the window. And I'm like, did you just throw that out the window? And she's like, yeah. I'm like, no, why did you do that? Oh my gosh. And I was just on my street. I'm like, I saw the cop turn <laughs> following me. My neighbor was like, huh, huh. do you hear that? I'm trying to talk and tell my story and he's like <laughs> so anyways I'm, I'm like this I see the lights turn on you know the blue and red lights and I'm like oh my god I, I was so panicked I'm like oh this is not good <clears throat> and she's like oh. she never even said sorry like she didn't even apologize for throwing it out the window she doesn't care, you know. Anyways, so he's like, <clears throat> he he came over and he he said, were you drink? He's like, oh, were you drinking tonight? You know, because it smelled like alcohol. <laughs> like we actually had the bottle in the front seat because I was bringing it back here, you know. Um, and I was like, I did. I had, you know, I'm not gonna lie. I did have a glass of wine, but she's here making excuses, be like, oh no, I had like four glasses of wine. That makes it even look worse, you know. I want a cigarette right now. Should I have one? Yeah. I want to, I feel like having a cigarette just because. Just a minute, let me pause this. He's such a loud yuck. <laughs> yuck you. Um, so yeah, like, oh look, I have a Newport, an open box. I have to make more smoking videos for my smoking channel. I'm so unhealthy. I'm sorry. I do have bad habits. I, 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 I'm not saying I'm an angel. I'm just dealing with the things I deal with in life. I don't know. Trust me. We all have problems. Like Shannon is dealing with shit and Sarah. Oh gosh. So anyways, yeah. So she, uh, I can't focus cause all I hear is like goofy, goofy, you know, goofy, the Disney character. I'm going to open the window too. And it's just going to be a whole lot of goofy. All right, so I can't believe she did that. And the cop was like, I smell alcohol, like, you know, and I'm like, so yeah, um, yeah. So he checked my, you know, my license and everything. And I really, I mean, I, I only had a glass of wine. So even if I did a few, like, I was thinking, you know, I, I think I should be okay. Even if they take a breathalyzer, you know, <sighs> Um, 
you know, I should be okay. <laughs> um, he came back and he was like a really nice guy. Like he actually, he said, I'm going to give you a warning. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, thank you. I was so worried because I could have got, you know, plus I smoked and stuff, but he, I don't, he didn't know that, but that could have got DUI and that would be bad. I would go to jail. I'd go back to jail for a year. Cause that, that would be my, th well, actually it's New Jersey. I don't know how it would be in New Jersey, but cause I had a DUI back in 2014 and, and it was in Pennsylvania. It was my second one, I guess, because I had one like nine years prior to that one. It, was, it wasn't 10 years. So I got as a second DUI. I know I gotta be careful. I don't do this. I'm not, I don't drink a drive. If I drink, I stay home. I actually prefer staying home. And sometimes I just like to be by myself, you know. Like, sometimes I just want to unwind. But anyway, so, um. Um. Yeah, so. Oh, he just gave me a warning. And I'm like, and he took Shannon's ID, too. He didn't give her a ticket for littering. He's like, what do you, you have an ashtray in here? What are you doing? Just throwing it out the window. I was like, I know, I told her, you know, I was so grateful though that I was so worried too. And I'm like, oh my God, that's just not good. Like you can't do that. You know, you just, you got to think before you do something really, I don't know. <laughs> you know, I don't know. Some I get paranoid too and weird and I'm thinking, what if she did that intentionally? What if she's trying to sabotage my life? Like, get me another DUI and then give me, um, hepatitis. I'm sorry. I don't mean to think that way, but sometimes I get weird. Like, I, I just, just weird. Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> so. Whew. I should take a picture for my smoking Patreon. Where am I? I do gotta make another video for my channel, my bad habits channel. We actually listened, watched that video last night. So Sarah came over. Shut the hell up, loud stuff. So Sarah came over with her boyfriend. She's like, yeah, we had beer and shots. So they came over and they had beer and shots, all right. They had two cans of Miller Lite and a little shot left of um Captain Morgan or something in a little one of those plastic things I was like those are your beer and shots <laughs> like I had a little bit of wine but you know it's like okay but I think she was all she was already drinking before I don't know so it was so crazy last night it was just too much it was like a, it was fun though um <coughs> excuse me I should have took a video of us being weirdos but maybe another time um I think Sarah took some videos <laughs> on her can on her phone though um, I'm like, Shannon, you're staying here though. Cause I'm not driving you home. I'm not going to drive. No way. So I slept on bed in my bed and she, I gave her a comforter for the couch. So I, I went to sleep. I was tired. Like Sarah, um, Sarah left and stuff. So I woke up this morning to go use the bathroom and I get up and she's gone. And I'm like, Oh, okay. She must've got a ride home. <laughs> I guess she went outside to have a cigarette and she locked herself out and she went to her house, which is down the street from me. And she just slept there. And I'm like, you know, the door was unlocked. She's like, oh, you know. Anyways. Uh, yeah, so I don't know. I really don't know. I'm just trying to take it easy. I really like to just make YouTube videos. That's my thing. I like doing that. To me, it's kind of like therapeutic. I don't know. I just like it. And I was supposed to pack today. I don't know what I'm going to wear when I'm out there, but he's like a, he sounds like goofy, doesn't he? He's always like that. Joe. And then Joyce is like, she has like a, I don't know. Ah. Anyways, I'm going to finish this cigarette and yeah.
gonna watch some TV or I don't know what I'm gonna do but I'm gonna call Mike I'm actually sleepy I don't know. I definitely gotta make more smoky videos, okay? Maybe I can make an ASMR smoky video. You know what I mean? And I definitely need to make more videos for my Patreon, so please, uh, well, this, you know, <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Pondering. <laughs> yeah, it was crazy <laughs> last night, and I have a small house too. It's like, but it was fun, you know? Uh, what else is there to talk about? I don't know. Not nothing much. Just I, am I getting a smoker's voice? <sighs> Tired. Yeah. So you know, Target is better than Walmart. I'm gonna make a video. I like Target better than Walmart, and I'm going to say why in that video, but I don't know when I'm going to make that video. Maybe another day. You know? I gotta start working now. Being healthy. Eating healthy. Because I'm getting, like, chubby. Ooh. <laughs> I don't know. Anyways. I'm so excited too, I'm getting more like subscribers, that's so cool, oh look the lipstick left that. <laughs> I'm gonna put the gamma down so you can see the normal. Oh, sorry. This is too crazy and bright. Oh, what did I do? I don't want my house to smell like cigarettes, so. That's what I hate. Oh, I don't like my house smelling like cigarettes, but it's too cold to sit outside. And I'm not going to make a video outside. Whoa. Oh, I'm going to put um, a link to our, my friend Faiza. She sent me... Oh, yeah, I did an unboxing video, too. She sent me a package and had all those goodies, so watch it if you can. And I'm going to put a link to her channel there. Gonna do that now. Uh, oh, shoot. Uh, Thanks so much for watching. Hey, I like it like this. Right? <sighs> Drinking, smoking, hey, you know, that's the way I do. Good evening. Or good morning, or whenever it is. I don't know, it says good afternoon, but I was just. I was just squeezing my fat on my stomach. Anyways, thank you again for watching.